Hello! This is a Forge scripting tutorial covering the undestroyed broadcaster. Now, I've gone over the basics of broadcasting in my Switch Broadcasters video, so for this one I'll be digging straight into the differences of undestroyed. So it can be found under scripting and triggers, and it's the undestroyed. And there is actually another version of this same broadcaster which can be found under gadgets and map gadgets, and it's the garage door switch. Now, these two broadcasters actually behave in exactly the same way. The only difference between them is that they look different. So, the way that the undestroyed broadcaster works is that this is a broadcaster that activates whenever you deal damage to it in some way. And that can include meleeing it, shooting it, throwing a grenade at it, uh, driving a vehicle into it really quickly, or even falling onto it from a really high height. Basically, any way you can think of doing damage to this is going to work. To show this broadcaster in action, I'm now going to link this up to a light. So with the undestroyed broadcaster, there's actually only one version of this, which is one that turns on a broadcast channel. There is no off or toggle variant. So I hit this, and it uh, goes ahead and turns off the light. So now I need to somehow turn the broadcast channel back off again. Uh, in this case, I'm going to use a timer and I'm going to make it that every time I activate the broadcaster, after three seconds, it will turn the channel back off again. So now I activate it, and three seconds later, it all resets itself. Another thing to note is that you don't need to damage the lit up part of the broadcaster. Damaging it anywhere will do. So to show here that really any kind of damage will do, I'm now going to fly up really high, and I'm going to land on this. And boom! As you can see, that still damages it, and that still activates it. Another thing to note is that you have to be able to do damage to activate the broadcaster. And to show that, I'm going to use a trait zone here that makes it so that whenever I enter the zone, I don't do any kind of damage at all. And if you look at the properties here, you'll see that I've set it to zero damage and zero melee damage. So now I enter the zone, and when I melee or shoot this, nothing happens because I can't damage it. And as soon as I leave the zone, it all works as expected. So, although this broadcaster can only ever turn on a broadcast channel, you can still kind of replicate on, off, and toggle behavior using a couple of these broadcasters and some timers. I've done that here with this garage door. So when I shoot this right one, the door begins to open, and when I shoot this left one, it closes back up again. And I can kind of just toggle between them. Now, I'll go into more detail in another video about how I've set that up, but for now, that covers the undestroyed broadcaster, and that actually covers all the broadcasters now across my videos. So next, I will be moving on to the listeners.